Welcome back to the UGF Paints. We're 2-1 on the season right now. Our only loss is to North Carolina thus far in this season, so I'd say we're doing pretty well. Today's game will be against Louisiana Monroe to kick off our Sun Belt run, and I certainly hope it's our last season in the Sun Belt. Right now we're sitting at 43 in the country. We're very close to being ranked. If we win a few more games in a row, we're there. And also, as you can see in the bottom corner, we're closing in on upgrading Tony Romo, which is, it's been so long since we've been able to do that. We need more of the kitchen sink, and then eventually we'll get the insta commits. Something I've certainly been struggling with, they're recruiting. Uh, I've done a terrible job this year. I apologize. The only significant guy that we're in the lead for is Richie Wallace. 85 run block. We're a good running team sometimes. I'd love to have him on the team. Phil Swift continues to drop. I'm, I'm throwing the max points at him. He's not ready for a visit just yet. It's a millimeter away. Give it another week and he'll be there. The only guy ready to visit this week is the number three tackle in the nation. He's got the A-plus playing time, of course, at UGF. Nearly every recruit would start almost immediately. Especially on the offensive line. We need some help. I think our best bet is week six with Idaho. He gets that complimentary visit as well. Looks like he's probably going to commit to Boise State before we even make it to week six, though. Next week, I probably got to redo my entire recruiting board. It's just a mess right now. But for now, I got to focus on the task at hand. And the task at hand is beating the Louisiana Monroe Warhawks. Our numbers have been a little bit low this year. But that's because we tanked our tune-up game. And then we played Georgia and North Carolina. Rayshon Tanner on a hot streak. Really? I feel like he hasn't contributed that much. Oh, that's right. We're playing in New Orleans at the, uh, the Superdome, I think that's what it's called. I forgot. But there's nobody here to watch us play. Love a good neutral site game? Hopefully this one is televised. I completely forgot to check. However, I highly doubt it's televised with the lack of fans in the stadium right now. We gotta make sure we shut down the run today. Eric Tyson kind of went off the mark. The other guy held him for a little bit while I made the tackle. Ah, oh, ULM, you're one of these hurry-up teams. Even if you go backwards, you're still going to be in the hurry-up. Threw that one out of bounds at the cornerback blitz. Got a little scared. Use our Brandon Montgomery right here. Over the middle, I missed him with Mitchell. Dang it. Send a blitz here, why not? Always oh, wide open, yep. Always open. He did not see that guy. Thank goodness. What the? Why'd the camera pull back like that? That was a little weird. I uh, ran coming up middle, but I did not have the right personnel. Easy first down for them. We dropped it. Flat out dropped it. We didn't even have good pressure on him. Over the middle. He dropped it again. He's going to the corner. Oh, he's got to be out of bounds. Thank goodness. I was about to say, I thought we had it locked up. Pretty short field goal. Oh my god, he barely made it. This kicker is not good. We're going to send the, the field goal return all day. Sunbelt opponents, I am not afraid to bring it out ever. We're playing aggressive the whole way. Ooh, Rayshon Tanner. After how he's been playing, I think Jeff Warren earned the starting spot in this game. That's a good cut. That's a good spin move. My goodness, yes. He is the right decision to be starting in this game. Okay, uh, now we're just going to drop it off short to Redick. He's had a very good season. The cuts. This is going to be a very easy game if they give us that much space to run. Man, you got to block those corners. I'm just going to launch it deep. Probably a little premature. Swat it down. That was a bad drive. Bad reads, everything. I've underestimated my opponent a little bit. I'm not going to let that stick. Oh, oh, I thought he was going to get a huge run there. That was scary. <laughs> With the, the, the formation they had, it was too easy to read. It was going to be an option no matter what. Come on, fumble that. Will Smith, literally, just put your hands out. and It's a free interception. The safety got in there, Reggie Manning. Ready for those corners. He didn't even have it on target. Clearly, their backup quarterback is not good enough to beat us. Reddick, go on and get that. They're playing so close to the line of scrimmage. Got to catch them up. Like, look at this. They have no safety on the left side. 
There's Denman. Finally, we have our first completion of the game. Took us a while. Got that one off. That went nowhere. I see Rayshon Tanner. Couldn't even get the pass off. Oh my goodness, they're blitzing. Ronnie Reddick has space. Go, son. 40 yards for Ronnie Reddick. And that'll move the chains. Dylan Brown. The fullback making a catch. That doesn't happen often. I can get one-on-one -on -one coverage. Now we're going to go run up the middle with Warren. Screw it. One yard short. He's in. QB sneak. Thank goodness. Glad we finally have points on the board. I'm not trying to lose to ULM. Somebody stripped that. He broke three tackles. Oh my lord. We got his ankles, but Jesus. The quarterback took it like 50 yards. Fullback's got it. Nobody's there. Touchdown. Would they do three option plays and they scored on that drive? That is unreal. Oh, fumble it. And the quarterback got it. This is ridiculous. A fumble pickup goes for 18 yards. I don't even know how to stop that. Nobody's covering that guy and didn't need to. He stepped out of bounds on his own accord. What the? I just saw Reggie Manning watch him go by. Get him, look at this again. He just stared him down. Get that Ramirez. Oh, good deflection. <laughs> it almost looked like he, the other guy was going to catch it though. Oh, it almost blocked it. I think I did get a hand on it. Tanner's going to bring it out of the end zone. Can this be a kick six? Cut around. Tanner. Oh, what that? Oh, what is going on? My own guy ran into me. I could have put that all over the thumbnail. Maybe I still will just to keep you guys on your toes. I don't know. Get there. Stance. Beautiful. That was an amazing catch. Get there, Sanders. Intercepted. No way. That's a darn shame. And he's shoving that guy off, that guy too. Horton makes the tackle. Yikes. Get there, Tyson. Like this guy has to fumble at some point, I swear. So it's a screen pass. That'll stop the clock a little bit farther back. Eight seconds left. To the corner. Warren gave him the hit. What is this flag? Please be a holding call. Pass interference. Offensive pass interference. Yes. We will accept. <laughs> They're really going to try this one? I think I missed the last kick from like 10 feet above and he's still going to try this one. That one's not even getting to the end zone. Rayshon Tanner, second try at it. Come on. Use that speed. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? He can't outrun a tight end. That's disappointing. I had two chances to get a kick six and I blew it. My thumbnail... My thumbnail. <laughs> I hope they're not in man defense so I can get down the field and score here. Whoa, barely got that one off. Cut up field, Warren. There's nobody blocking. This has been a disappointment. Negan Stance, the out route. Oh, took a pretty big hit there. Look, they are not respecting our pass game, so we're just going to keep throwing it. I'm going testing him. Negan Stance almost picked off off the tip. Decent run by Jeff Warren. I think that's the first positive run we've had in ages. They are a blitzen. We have a guy, a wide open, but it was thrown behind him. All right, Andy Francis, give me a good one. Wow, that is a thick leg on that kid. Our absolute unit of a kicker slots one from 48 yards. <laughs> See, like, he's 6 of 16 on passes, and it's still a tie ball game. I don't get it. Boom! Did not let him get that one easily. 6 of 17. We've dominated the passing game. Lucky we didn't. Will Smith break on it? I tried to. Wow, that guy's open. That guy's even more open. Reggie Manning, please. Mitchell, touchdown, 56 yards. Guy's 8 of 19, and he's beating us. I'm testing him with Negan Stance. Negan Stance 
The only one on this offense that wants to win the game. I need you now, Stanson. It didn't work. Fourth and ten. Are we going to lose to Louisiana Monroe, really? Somebody grabbed those off the tip, man. We could have had the interception. It's a screen pass. Kendrick, sack him, please. Yes. That'll get us back in the game. Good work, defense. Look, I'm not complaining that they're still trying these field goals, but at some point you'd think that they would stop. The kids already missed, what, like three on the day? Okay, I caught this one again. Third time is the charm. Just beeline it for the side. Cut back again. Now, I, I, that was the worst one of the day. <laughs> I think we technically get credit for turnovers whenever we catch those, though, so that's, that's a nice bonus. So there's a keeper for Horton, and I'm liking it. Go, Horton. Biggest run of the season. We got a block from Stance. That's clutch. That's going to be a touchdown. That's going to tie the game. This is quite a risky play, but I'm willing to give it a go. Roman Hadley, Brandon Montgomery teaming up for the tackle. They're going to be short of the first down. They're going to have to punt this one. It is now the fourth quarter. It's a tie football game. Shaping up to be a good finish. They're sending a lot of pressure. Reddick, oh, he made his first drop of the season, but I can't blame him. Got hit right as he caught it. Well, we got to punt it here. Do not want to blow the game based on field position. Jeff Warren was not there. Roman Hadley had to make the tackle. Oops, I was talking about field position. They, they're starting it off with great field position. Nobody's there. Oh, my. We all got flattened by their old line. What the heck was that? That was like a free sack for us. Oh, it's a slant route in. He wasn't there to stop him. Oh, it's a screen pass. That's going to be a touchdown. Yep, could not get there in time. They take the lead here in the fourth quarter. Still a lot of time on the clock. We're not out of it yet. I'm throwing it deep. Sanders, a little overthrown. See Denman here? Bailed me out on third down. Maybe the, the fullback in there will help us out. Let's get to the corner. We ran a lot for eight yards, but much needed. It's third down and three. We have not gone to Dylan Brown at all today. This is our time. He got it. Six yards for the big man. I see him on the slant. McDonald. Pulling up field for another first down. We're so lucky to still be alive on this drive. This has got to be to Jeff Warren. He's got to be faster than that guy, right? Denman is all open. Got to do this in a way to where they don't have time to score after we do. We, we got to get the touchdown first. So I, I, what am I even talking about? Oh, there we go. I'm just going to walk it in. Not going to take the risk. You never know what can happen on the goal line. So we're just going to tie the game up here with 1 minute 26 seconds. Maybe not the most efficient clock management ever. But we got all three timeouts. I believe in my defense. We're going to win this game. Screen pass. Get there, Tyson. Oh, he fell into his own offensive lineman. That's a six-yard loss. He's running. We have the QB spy ready for him. Third and 20. Should be an easy stop. Just keep him in front of you. Will he go there? How did he possibly get open? How did we let that happen? He's trying to scramble. That's going to be a sack. This is so stressful. Time's ticking down. Not sure what to do here. Probably won't be calling any more timeouts. That's so. They're really letting this clock tick down now. Five seconds left on the play clock. 13 in the game. They really want overtime, don't they? To the corner. He's got it. No, that's not good. They almost are in field goal range. No, wait, he didn't catch it. Third and 13, what am I saying? He's going deep. It's a Hail Mary play. Will Smith. He's caught it. What the heck? Did we block it? No, that's game. The worst kicker in the country wins on a walk-off kick against us because we had the wrong defense on the field. Should have iced him or something. Man, I didn't even think. My mind was all over the place. That is... Not one we should have lost. ESP in classic game. Get out of my face. That was a shame. Well, we got an upgrade available for Tony Romo, but that one does not sit well with me. 
I know you guys are gonna be upset with me for like not clutching that one out. So many missed mistakes. Final stats, Will Horton, 18 of 32, 191 passing yards, one interception. I mean, he didn't really play like a bad game, in my opinion, at the quarterback position, but he didn't do anything impressive. He did run the ball very well, though 89 yards, three touchdowns. Receiving yards, Negan Stance was clearly the only one who wanted to win this game. On the defense, Brandon Montgomery, six tackles, two for loss. Uh, for sacks, we had a ton of them. Technically, catching those missed field goals counts as a fumble recovery, so Rayshon Tanner had three. We let them get 403 yards of total offense. That's terrible. Like, it was just an ugly game all around. And I am the one to blame. So yes, I am sure the hate mail will be headed my way. <sighs> close, but no cigar. UGF keeps it close, but still comes up short against ULM. I can complain all day. Nothing we can do about it now. Gotta move on and try to win throughout the rest of the season. Nothing I can do about it now. Gotta move on, try to win out the rest of the season. And we're going to put that in kitchen sink. Gives us 100 extra points in recruits each week. We are now at B plus coaching prestige, and they're saying, it's not easy walking out of the stadium with your head up after a loss. I mean, after beating Georgia, our best win in school history, we dropped two in a row to North Carolina and Louisiana Monroe. Things are looking up next week. We're playing 0-4 Idaho, and they look terrible. We're ranked better than them in nearly every single category, so we should come away with a win. Welcome back to the UGF Pandas. Yes, we're coming off a terrible loss against Louisiana Monroe. We're just gonna look past that and never talk about it again. Cool. In this episode, we're playing the Idaho Vandals. They are 0-4 on the season, so if we don't win this game, wh what do I usually say? Yeah, I'll delete my channel. Let's not let that happen, because I like my channel. It brings me great happiness. Everybody's favorite lad, Phil Swift, is ready to visit this week. See, it's not looking good. He might commit to Miami next week. So if we don't get this visit scheduled ASAP, he's gonna be gone. A lot of people would go against this strategy, even though we don't get the extra bonus for scheduling it late in the season, I'm doing it anyway. He might not be available later in the season. We're gonna break the lock here on Scott Sears, and that moves us into second place. Very needed, and he's scheduled to visit this week, so that could be huge for us. Thief, we got an achievement for that? <laughs> I like it. There's that Auburn fullback again here in the Heisman race. 0-4 on the season. These guys, I hope they're trash. I need a dang tune-up game. It's been a rough season so far. We need Phil Swift and his flex tape on the team. Man, it's been a minute since we've been in the Adama Dome. Time to show up for the home fans get this Swift W for our man, Phil Swift. They're going to be running the football a lot today. There are Tysons there, ready for it. Get there, Will Smith. I usered that one in the backfield. That was an easy stop. They're blitzing. Oh, I should have hit the guy on the drag, and now we had a fumbles. That'll move us back nine yards. It's third and 24. And now it's time for some Calhoun again. See, we got Reddick over the middle. He made the catch, it's gonna be fourth and two. I say we go for this one, why not? A 65 yarder, yep, no way Andy Francis is making that one. Rodney Calhoun take off. Not much of a runner, but he's just enough to get the first. Rayshon Tanner back at it, moving the chains. Dylan Brown's open, fullback, get to the corner. Receiving touchdown for the fullback. Sacked him. Uh, we're all over it. They do not look like a good passing team. Bradley, make a play on the ball. Don't just sit back on it. He's dropping it short. Who's covering that spot? Guys, we need the picks. We need to impress Phil Swift. Oh my! That animation doesn't even make sense. That guy just exploded off of him. Get there, McBride. I tried to go screen pass, did not work. Fourth and seven from the dang Panda logo. He got it up, slightly left, he missed it. We're hitting stance. We caught it. That, that corner was all over him too. Stance, good catch through the contact. He's had two big catches on this drive. Oh no, they're blitzing. I'm gonna stop, throw it to Tanner. He threw off a guy. Oh my, what an effort, 16 yards. We got the block, touchdown. We're up by two scores now. Let's not blow this lead. No chance, like they've done absolutely nothing on the ground. It's an option play, he got it off, Will Smith. Hold up. What an angle, that is devastating. 
Mitchell, please tackle him. Whew. Sigh of relief. Montgomery all over this game. He's throwing it to the corner. And I thought we had his own there. Dudu, that's a touchdown for him. Guys, 66 on the game. We have no deflections. We have no interceptions. Phil Swift is just cooling it on the sidelines, being disappointed with the Pandas. Let's see, let's go drag route. Dimmon, pick it up. That is going to move the chains. Not going to call a timeout yet. Slant. Stance again. Back-to-back -back plays for first downs. Get rid of that. Come on. You're going to have to burn a time. A third and 23. I see him over there. He's They're going to catch up to him, though. Daniel freaking Sanders. Holy Lord. Oh, I don't even know what to say. I can't even commentate that. That was such a beautiful catch. I was ready for the interception. I was ready for the end of the drive. But we might get some points. Denman just in time. The juke, and he got out of bounds. Got something crazy up our sleeve. Oh, they're ready for this. But we're ready for them. Calling the timeout. We got eight seconds. Now's the time to go in zone fade, right? No, we're going to try to scramble in. Threw that one to the ground. Two seconds. Do I just take the field goal here? Or do I go ballsy? I think the smart thing to do is take the chip shot, take the free points, because we do get ball first in second half. Okay, this is a Horton run. It's been a while since we've scrambled with the quarterback. But that's what he does best. 14 yards for Will Horton. Tanner's got the hole. He capitalized on it for 13 yards. McDonald's got it. The Jukes. Oh, I thought he was going to go the distance. Let's go, Horton. Got around that guy. That's going to be a touchdown. Classic Horton. He is dominating this game, showing why he's our number one QB. That's a sack all day. He's trying to take off. Montgomery. We got him fourth and inches, barely. Sacked him. That's the cornerback going in there for the sack. Yeah, dang it, I can't cover both spots. They just ran four verts and couldn't cover it. Tanner, get to the corner. First down. Oh, we got Jeff Warren. Makes a great grab. Run around that blitz. Will Horton's taken off. Breaks one. 18 yards. The Jukes, oh no way. I thought Will Horton was gonna go into the end zone. Come on, Brown. The spin move, that was amazing. That right there could have won us the game. Touchdown. They blitzed the wrong side. Easy six points for Will Horton. No one's open. He fumbled it, we picked it up. That'll put a stamp on this game. But I'm going for more points. Take off Horton. Get there. Another one for him. We're just rubbing it in now. We swatted it. Intercepted. We got one of the turnovers we needed. Mike Marquand. We've had two turnovers on the past two plays. That's a first. I'm going to call a timeout. We're still going to try for the end zone. There you go, Denman. Moving the chains again. We got three seconds. I'm still going for the end zone, baby. We got Denman over here. Overthrown, and that'll be the end of the game. Dang it, Horton. Well, we started to run away with it there. Really was never close at any point of the day. Will Horton, definitely player of the game. Brandon Montgomery led us in tackles with four, and we had a ton of tackles for loss. Jeez, we dominated this game in terms of yardage. 397 to 190. Yes, offensive and defensive coordinator upgrade. I love those. Those are the best. Phil Swift has locked us out. Dud of the year. Let's go with the zone upgrades. Trying to get more interceptions around here. Let's add some to the running ones. One break tackle, two spin move, and three elusiveness. Feel like it can't hurt. Your team executed when they had to and came up with the big plays. Good win, coach.
Such a big victory over 0-5 Idaho, I know. But for real though, we needed that. It was a big morale boost. Next week, we're gonna be taking on Louisiana Lafayette. They are two and three on the season, but they're always a pretty difficult opponent. Anyways, that's pretty much all I have for this video. I wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends of my book, and as for me, I am True Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Yeah, Warren's like, I'm good. Don't worry about me, coach. He's walking away from the huddle. He has no idea where he is. Oh, yeah. He's got the spins, but then he can hit him with the spins.